Hey man, welcome back to the Super Divorce YouTube channel. Welcome. Nicholas Villar is here, aka Super Divorce. You know, if you're going to make a Simpsons game in 2023, what better source of inspiration than 2011's Treehouse of Horror 22? In particular, a story from that episode called Dial D for Diddly, a Dexter parody featuring Ned Flanders as a serial killer. Well, that's exactly the source of inspiration that was used for a brand new Simpsons fan game called Ned Flanders Kills the Simpsons. If this were a more realistic game, it might have been titled The Writing Staff Kills the Simpsons. <laughs> From prolific indie horror developer David Mills, this quick yet fairly disturbing first-person slasher has the player controlling a completely unhinged Ned Flanders. You're tasked simply with killing the entire Simpsons family one badam one. And you get to choose between a hammer and a kitchen knife while doing so. Now, I know the Treehouse of Horror episodes don't shy away from the macabre, but even with the show accurate visuals and audio clips pulled directly from Simpsons episodes, there's something unsettling about stalking the Simpsons family. With the exception of one child, all of your victims are totally defenseless, bleeding copiously and slumping along like wounded animals as you stab or bludgeon them to their unfortunate ends. You might find yourself asking why Flanders would ever do such a thing. Well, in the episode this game was inspired by, Homer uses a voice changing device to convince Flanders that he's being instructed by the voice of God to murder all of Homer's enemies. However, no such narrative is provided here. We're just to assume Ned's gone psycho. And he would have gotten away with it too, spoiler alert, if it weren't for the youngest Simpson, baby Maggie, who unloads several revolver rounds into Ned's carcass in a game-ending cutscene that triggers as soon as the player opens her bedroom door. This, of course, is a nod to the who shot Mr. Burns storyline that ended season 6 and began season 7 of The Simpsons. And I'm grateful the ending played out how it did. As I opened the door to Maggie's room and saw her crib, I honestly thought I was going to have to bow out. I know it's just a game, I know, but I don't think going through with the slaughter of an innocent baby would have been an experience worth having, digital as it might have been. The envelope of horror was pushed just far enough here. Ned Flanders Kills the Simpsons is free on itch.io. If you'd like to try it out for yourself, there's a link in the description below. And if you haven't done so, please sub to the channel, bong the gong for notifications, and comment below if you got anything to say. Let me know your thoughts on this one. You can follow me on Twitter at SuperDivorce, on Instagram at SuperDivorceBand, and check out Super Divorce Music wherever you like to stream your horse shit any streaming platform of your choosing. Until next time, everyone. Take real good care. Keep kicking ass. Love you lots. Lord willing, I'll be back very soon with another video for you to watch. Uh, bye bye Goodbye. We can go viral with this one.